Hello everybody, welcome to Kanchi's Kitchen. Today I will be preparing coriander chicken. To prepare this chicken, I have taken 1 kilo of chicken, 5 to 6 tomatoes chopped, a big bunch of coriander leaves, 2 green chilies, 1 tablespoon poppy seeds, 2 small cinnamon sticks, 4 to 5 cloves, 1 star anise, 1 teaspoon cumin seeds, 1 teaspoon fennel seeds, 2 bay leaves, 3 cardamoms, 4 to 5 onions chopped, 2 tablespoon red chili powder, 1 teaspoon turmeric powder, 2 tablespoon coriander seeds, 3 teaspoons ginger garlic paste. Wash the chicken and drain the water out. Add 1 teaspoon salt and half teaspoon red chili powder. Mix this and keep it aside. Grind the coriander leaves with the green chilies. Heat a pan. Once the pan is hot, add the coriander seeds. Dry roast them. them for a minute. Add bay leaves, cardamom, cloves and cinnamon. Fry for another half a minute. Now add cumin seeds, fennel and, and poppy seeds. Roast them for another minute. Heat a heavy bottom pan. Add 4 tablespoon oil. Once the oil is hot, add onion. onions until they are golden in color. Coriander seeds have cooled down. I will just put it in a blender and dry grind them to a fine powder. The onions have turned golden in color. Add ginger garlic. Cook the ginger garlic until the last one is gone. The oil is separating from the mixture. Add tomatoes. Stir, add a pinch of salt, stir, by adding salt, the tomatoes will cook faster, cover, put the flame on to medium, cook this for 5 minutes. The tomatoes have been cooking for 5 minutes now, now add the ground coriander, put the heat back on to high and cook this for another 2-3 minutes. Now this mixture has been cooking for 5 minutes. Cover and cook for another 5 minutes. Now this is cooking for now this has been cooking for 5 minutes. You can see that the chicken has started cooking in its own juices. One more small teaspoon of salt as I've already added. One, one small teaspoon for, uh, for marinating the chicken. Add the turmeric powder, red chili powder, and the dry roasted spices. Give a good stir. Cover and cook for another 5 minutes, 5 to 10 minutes. The chicken has been cooking for 10 minutes now. You can see the oil floating on top of the gravy. Now add one and half cup of hot water. Add two teaspoon ghee. Just check the seasoning. This is really spicy. Add less chili powder if you feel like. Cover and cook for another 10 to 15 minutes on low flame. Coriander chicken is ready to serve. I have garnished this with coriander leaves. 